everyone, AJ Delisandanda with wet hair here. And in the background, you'll see Robin, Sonali, and then we have Marjorie there as well. But yes, Robin and Sonali are here because I have a doll to open. And I know the last video that you saw from me was an opening video. <laughs> Sorry, I keep buying dolls. Um, this doll was one that I bid on on Australian eBay and no one else bid on her? Hmm? Um, this box is like barely American girl height so hopefully she's not contorted into a weird position to get her shipped from one side of Australia to the other. Fingers crossed she's okay. Um, also fingers crossed she's in good condition. The photos were kind of hard to see. Um, I think she's just like your number 12, but in my head canon, she's my Gwen. So I have Sonali and Chrissa. Um, and if you are new to American Girl and aren't sure on who these dolls, I'm just saying names to you. Um, Chrissa, girl of the year 2009, had two best friend dolls that came, like that you could also buy. Um, Sonali, who is here, she's quite hard to find and in my opinion, the best for the three, sorry, uh, Robin slash Chrissa. I call my Chrissa Robin just because I like the name better. Um, but yeah, Sonali was the rarest and hardest to find. Um, and then Gwen, who is blonde haired with bangs and brown eyes, um, was the other best friend. Now, before this, there was a doll, just like you, number 12, who looked really similar to Gwen. Um, and I believe she was taken off shelves, maybe put back on shelves after. This doll has a 2012 body tag, so she's not a Gwen, um, but you know, in my head canon she is. Like, it's the same doll, it just is a different body tag and a slightly different name, and one's more expensive than the other, so I'm gonna call my just like you number 12 Gwen. <laughs> Let's open her. Alright. Oh, she's cute. Tight limbs. Yeah, for number 12, I think. Her hair is dry. I think I'm gonna go at it with a steamer. Yeah, that is dry. Girly. Her dry hair. I'm in my Taylor Swift hoodie and she does have Taylor Swift bangs, so that's the first thing I'm noticing. She doesn't have pie bangs, she's got the, the revised bang style, which is very cute. I do have a doll who's classic mold, brown eyed and blonde haired, who is my just like you, number 24, Raven, who was my first doll. She looks very similar to Raven. Um, but I don't think I mind it. They're different dolls. This doll has a really like defined like butt. Like that dip is more uh, extreme than I'm seeing on other dolls. Yeah. This girl has a very messy wig. It's very thin, very thin. I can see her wig cap at the back. Has it been cut? No, it hasn't been cut, it's just thin. Wow. But I'm also spoiled because my Just Like You number four, Samire, who's there, has the most thick and luscious wig. And she was the last doll I opened. So. But she doesn't have like any marker in her hair. It's actually she's actually in pretty good condition. She does have a kind of strange like back of the neck. She has, she's stamped American Girl. She's stamped American Girl, but then has some numbers underneath it. If anyone knows what that means, please let me know. I might do a little bit of research. She's a bit grubby. I'm gonna clean her up a little bit. Put her in an outfit. But yeah, this is she. I'm back. <laughs> so I've zhuzhed her up. I did end up going over her hair with the steamer and it made a huge difference. It's way less gritty at the ends. Um, she reminds me so much of my number 24, but I don't think it bothers me and I think they might be either cousins or like... Raven already has like a family tree, uh, but she might be one of Raven's siblings because Brielle is her older sister. And she originally had a twin brother named River. Um, who has since been returned back to a Puss and Company, Samantha. So maybe Gwen will take River's place as Raven's twin. But this is my Gwendolyn. 
Gwen for short, who I believe is a number 12, not actually Gwen. But I'm not complaining because she's still gorgeous. Like the little flip at the bottom of her hair, so pretty. I made her this cute little like activewear set because she's my Pilates girly. Like, think goes to a very fancy gym, does her Pilates, studying nursing, um, just a sweet little lady. Like, I think she's super fun. Yes, I did get two dolls in the span of a week. And that is excessive. <laughs> but if you find a girly who's on your list for 50 Australian dollars, you jump on it. <laughs> like 50 bucks, that's pretty good. Uh, that is like a fifth of what I paid for um, Samire, who is my number four, which I'm not complaining because Samire is everything. And just like your number four is everything. But 50 bucks for a Gwen-ish. I'm happy with that. And she's so cute. Like, something about this like short banged wig is so fun. Like, I am obsessed with this wig. So now I have a Gwen to go with my Chrissa. Oh, concussion. I have all three! <laughs> eee! So I finally have a Sonali, a Gwen, and Robin, my Cressa. And they look great together, like, there's a reason these three are best friends. Now, there is gonna be some drama in the dollhouse because Robin has a best friend and it's Piper. And they are best friends, but I think you can have more than one friend. Like, maybe she was best friends with these two growing up, and now they're at uni, they have different friend groups, and that's okay. Like, they're still friends, they still get along. Nice and early. Just gonna pop it back here. But I think I need to go take photos of the three of them together, because they look great. Might have to change their outfits into something a bit more cohesive. Currently they look very different to each other. of my 2009 girlies in like bunny air quotations because we're ignoring that my Gwen isn't actually a Gwen but she's still cute and she looks identical to a Gwen if anyone in the comments knows to confirm if there's any like proper correct confirmation other than body tag because she, if she has a 2012 body tag like has she gone to the doll hospital? I don't know. Either way, she's so cute. I know Christy from AG Takes Over says that her Gwen is the prettiest, but she's pretty gorge. There's something about these wigs. The little, the wigs with the bangs. She's really cute. Like, I am very happy with her. Two dolls with bangs in the last week. Yeah, I think my favorite dolls are dolls with bangs. I say that, but Kimberly and I number 29 is my favorite. Hmm? <laughs> All right, long and rambly video. Me Gwen and her cute new outfit that I'm very happy with. Pretty good for literally all of this fabric that I had left. I got it um, for like five bucks for a filler bag of scraps, which is great for doll clothes. And I had this like brown knit jersey I was like, ah, what am I going to use it for? And I'll hold on to it with the little fabric order I am. And the perfect amount for a doll matching set. How great is that? Okay. I'm going to go take some photos of this gorgeous girly. Maybe all three together. We'll see. See you later. <laughs>